Let's now take a look at what's trending on Vion's social media platforms as well. On Vion's Instagram, a day after developing technical difficulties, Russia's Luna 25 probe has crashed into the moon. Informed Russia's space agency on Sunday, the Luna 25 probe was the first Russian moon mission in nearly 50 years. From Vion's Facebook page, Iraqi authorities issued an order to shut down advertisement screens, LED advertisement screens throughout Baghdad following a brazen hack that displayed explicit content. The incident occurred at the heart of the Iraqi capital, where a hacker managed to project a pornographic film for several minutes before being halted by security forces. The scandalous act shared widely on social media forced the authorities to take immediate action. On Vion's X page, Germany's Federal Minister for Digital and Transport, Volker Weising, had a first hand experience of convenience of using India's digital payment interface, the UPI, during his recent visit to Bengaluru for the G20 Digital Ministers meeting. The German mission in India took to X, formerly known as Twitter, as the minister from Berlin expressed great fascination with the sheer convenience of using the digital payment service popular in India. From Vion's YouTube channel, Pakistan Christians in Pakistan's Punjab province sat among the rubble of their ransacked church for the first Sunday service. This because the Muslim mob rampaged through the neighborhoods in eastern Punjab. Over 80 Christian homes and 19 churches were vandalized. And finally, from our website, expanding India's avenues of cooperation with Oman and Mauritius, the Indian Space Agency, ISRO, is working with their counterparts from the respective nations to build and launch satellites for them and offering them the benefits of space applications and space-based services. The ISRO leadership, led by a Chairman Dr. S. Somnath, recently hosted delegations from Oman and Mauritius at the ISRO facilities in Bengaluru, also known as the Airspace City of India. And with that, we call to wrap on this edition of the News Bulletin. News and updates continue on the other side on We On World is One. Stay tuned. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.